Yo, 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 what is going on everyone? Evil Sin here, and today we are back with another World War II video, and if you guys are new, please hit that sub button. We are slowly working our way to 400 every single day, but yes, hopefully you guys like one of my recent videos where I did the Piranha Surprise deck. Now, this one is kind of like another Piranha Surprise deck, but I'm just not going to focus on the Piranha Surprise. I'm going to be focusing on Stir Your Bomb, the Safety Dome, Rex, and a lot of other things in this deck. Alrighty, so let me break down this deck for you guys. Um, I already said it's a 2.3 dough cost, and this is what we have. We have Overclock, Freeze Trap, Caveman, Minimander, Sir Your Bomb, which is going to be a, one of the best cards in this deck. And then we have Safety Dome, Rex, and then to end it all, we have Piranha Surprise. If you guys end up trying this deck out at home, let me know and comment down below and tell me if it worked for you, okay? Um, I've only tried this deck one time. I tested it before I even started recording, and it looked like it was going to do good, but um, I just have to know how to play it right. So let's see if we can get a couple of good wins in this video. Hit that like button, guys, if you guys haven't done that already. Give me some good luck. We're about to hop into our first match. All right. I'm going to stand up for this because I really, really want to focus right now. All right, so we're versing a guy named Multi Turbo, and he's a clown skin. And I really wish that I had one of the clown skins, but I'm just going to wait until it comes into the shop because a lot of people have been telling me that you can now buy commander skins using the dough balloons. Now, you guys can correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section below, but a lot of people were telling me that in the Discord that... That uh, in the future, we'll be able to, you know, buy commander skins with the dough balloons. And I think that'll be way better, you know, because back then, dough balloons were just a waste of time. And people were like, oh, more dough balloons? I don't need these. But, like, with the commander skins, you know, a lot of people are going to be wanting them, you know. But uh, that's just my opinion. Correct me if I'm wrong. I might be wrong. But uh, I don't know. It's just I haven't seen a commander skin come into the shop yet. So if I end up do like finding a commander skin in the shop i will record it and i'll show you guys but uh hopefully you know it's the clown skin or maybe you know another one i would i would love to you know get the clown skin but any other new skin uh i'll, I'll definitely be willing to take but uh okay i'm actually pretty surprised that this guy haven't hasn't even tried to take up my rex eggs like not even one of them like now we have two rex eggs about the hatch and we're oh no he dropped down that those yetis but that's fine uh, the Yetlings, I call them Yetis, but they're, I guess they're mini yet Yetis. Alright, go back a little bit. Okay, keep going. Alright, we got a big push coming right here on the left side. This guy's a little bit screwed. In a couple more seconds, I might drop that TNT right in his arms. Oh no, he drops those piranhas. Okay, TNT right there. Don't move, bro. Go back. Go back to your tower. <laughs> no, my God. Oh my god, he just helped his own tower break. Thank you. Thank you, bro. <laughs> you just helped me. Thank you. What a helpful opponent. Thank you so much, Multi Turbo. If you're watching this right now, shout out to you. I, I really don't know how this match is going to end. Like, his commander still has a lot of health left, and I want to make sure that I don't mess up. Because he does have those infestation mines and stuff like that. So, oh no, safety dome. Oh, such a good friggin' card. Like it really does save you from you know the acid puddles and from you know like an air strike and stuff like that. If you guys don't know, uh, try out the safety dome because it really does help protect your like your troops and cards and stuff. It really does help. Right, we got 20 seconds. Let's see if we can probably push towards him. Oh, he's got a wasp nest. Is this his first time dropping it in this match? I think it is. We got 18 seconds. 16, 15, 14. All right, this is going to be, like, um, pretty heavy at the end. Oh, no, it's not. I thought he was going to rush, like, very hard at the end, but he didn't really rush that hard. All right, I guess that's how we're going to end that uh, the first match. We ended up taking his left tower right at the beginning of the video. And, uh, wow. Okay. Good game, multi-turbo. All right, let's go into our second match. Uh, hopefully, you know, this one's a little bit better than the first one. Uh, let's just see, you know, if we can take his commander out this time. Or, you know, you know, both towers. I don't really like winning with just one tower because I feel like it's kind of cheap. But, uh, you know, I, I just kind of like winning while taking out the commander. It just, it feels better when you kill the commander than the towers. I don't know. That's just me. Okay, here we go. Reversing Septism. 
Septism from Final Boss. I don't know, that just sounds like a weird name. But, uh, okay, here we go. He's a level 9. I'm a level 10, so you guys know what's up right now. I got that one up. Mini Manda right there. And then we have that Overclock. No! Okay, he's got, he's working with Suryu Bomb as well. Okay, uh, so that's pretty good. I think the last guy was working with Suryu Bomb as well. Roger. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Oh, if we had that dome right there, I would have placed it right there, but I didn't have it in my hand. Three, two, one. There we go. Blow him up. Now, look at that. Now he's put TNT in my hands, and I put it in his hands. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. All right, yeah, he's got the health tower still, so, yeah. I knew he was, I knew he was gonna heal up. And um, I, I just waste that 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 health tower, but I also learned that like if you do heal and stuff like that, um, it does heal up your mini mander. And I just I don't know I kind of just wasted it because the mini mander doesn't really have that much health. But uh, I don't know. Like so, sometimes it will you know um, help you if you heal up your mini mander, but sometimes you know they just die very quickly. That's that's okay though because I am working with the overclock so. I can just, you know, cycle fast and get it back to, you know, the the right heal tower that we want. Dude, we're just going back and forth with Sir Your Bombs right now. <laughs> like, legit. If we get him down to less than 2,000, we can probably put the TNT right in his hands. But my luck, he's probably going to heal up. Yeah, I just freaking said that. Oh my god. What is the chances? Okay, he puts a kill bot right there, so let's put that piranhas right in the back. All right, he's like, I'm not sleeping on those piranhas, I'm gonna take them out, but okay. All right, he puts that, uh, the hurt bot down. We do have that safety gun, but we just used it. And he just stole my mini mander, because he's got troop trap, I guess. That's the first time he used it in, in this match. <sighs> okay, those bees do a lot of damage. They're crazy damage with those bees. But they have, like, no health. No! I can't even... Oh, my gosh. I hate when this happens. Oh, my God. Like, like I'm click I'm trying to click on the hurt bot, and then it's just clicking on the dough barrel. I hate when that happens. Tell me, tell me, does that happen to you guys as well? Like, when you're trying to click on the enemy, and it's, like, right, up, like, right in front of the dough barrel, and you can't even click on it? It, like, almost, like causes you to lose the game because like you can't even click on that unit all righty let's see if we can end this match right here sir your bomb on his right tower three two one and that's how it's done like that guys that is exactly how it's done oh my gosh we ended it just like how we did it in the first one but we took the tower right at the end this time all righty I'm, I'm crossing my fingers i really want this last match to be the best one i really want to go out with a bang okay all right, so hopefully we reverse someone good right here. All right, so we're reversing um, Saw544 from Doe Runners 2. And uh, shout out to you, bro. If you're watching this right now, nothing but respect. Nothing but respect for every single one of uh, the people that I go up against. And nothing but respect for all of my viewers. You guys are legit amazing. God bless every single one of you. All right, so here we go. This guy is just like really wants to take my tower down for some reason. I don't know what this guy's game plan is. He's like, yeah, I'm just going to lock right onto your tower. And I'm like, nah, bro. I'm going to put that safety dome there and protect my tower. Drop down my Prana Surprise. He drops his Witch down, and he drops his Prana Surprise down. Okay, that's surprising. And he's at 3,000, and he's not healing. Why, why are you not healing up? He's at 966. Okay, now he's healing up. I was about to say, this is a noob right here, guys. But it's, it's not a noob. It's almost a noob. But, um... Three, two, one. Okay. This game, this match might actually be pretty quick. Because this guy doesn't seem like he knows how to play the game. And yeah, I'm just going to let him blow up with the TNT. Good night. <laughs> oh my god, bro. Good night. That is how you end the video right there. Like, literally, this deck is explosive. And um, if you guys haven't tried this deck out, I definitely recommend trying this deck out. And um, if it doesn't work for you you know just put 
just change something out of it, you know, put shut down in there if you guys want to. But uh, just tell me how it worked for you guys, and uh, hopefully it didn't get you any losses or something like that because, you know, losses suck. You know, we always want to focus on wins because wins are the only things that give us, you know, trophies and stuff. And, you know, we never want to lose trophies. We always want to go positive and stuff like that. But, uh, yes, hopefully you guys did like this video. And if you guys are new, please hit that sub button. It'll help me out so much. I am slowly working my way to 400 every single day. But, uh, you know, one day we will get there. Just like how in one day we will be at 1,000 subscribers. And, like, I cannot even imagine that day coming. But I know it will come one day. You know, look at that. 100 dough balloons. I'll take that. But, um, yeah, I, I just... I cannot even imagine, you know, hitting like 400 and I, I didn't even, I couldn't even imagine hitting 200 or even 300, but we're here. And, uh, you know, I just want to thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. Uh, you guys really, truly mean a lot to me and, uh, you guys really do support me, um, a lot. And, um, I don't know. I just want to thank you guys so much, but you know, um, I, I could, th I could be thanking you all day and it just wouldn't be enough. But anyways, guys, if you guys liked the video, don't forget to hit that like button, okay, guys? And comment down below if you guys want to see any more videos, you know, like, uh, if you guys have, like, an idea of me, make, like, making a video with, like, a certain card that you guys like, or, like, any certain deck that you guys like, or, you know, just, like, me brainstorming, like, future cards for the game. You know, I can definitely do that, but, uh, I'm Evil Sin. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.